Hey everyone, ST Tekken here, and today I'm talking about a very obscure HR Puffin Stuff topic. One I'm surprised doesn't have that much documentation. HR Puffin Stuff had a presence at the Universal Studios theme park in Hollywood, California around 1970, but possibly earlier. And it's sadly not been well documented, as I can only find free photos regarding it, and besides some info included on one of the descriptions of said photos, I could not find anything else regarding this, like, info-wise or photo-wise. But what I could find is very interesting and really cool to talk about. So let's get right into it. Let's start with the HR Puffin Stuff exhibit. That's right. You heard me. In the 1970s, Universal Studios had a full-on HR Puffin Stuff exhibit that featured screen-used costumes and sets from the show. And possibly the movie as well. Sadly, the only pick of the exhi exhibit I could find, or that exists online, um, was Seymour Spider in one of the Witchy Poo's castle guards in front of Witchy Poo's castle. But besides that, um, I couldn't find any other photos regarding it. But th there was info included on the photo, like in the description of the photo sale. And here's what it said. And basically what it said is, the photo was from 1975, but considering how like late that was compared to other Puffin Stuff events, I'm assuming that the, the exhibit was around since at least, at most, 1971. But I could be wrong, but it could be earlier than 1975. But sadly, that's all I can really talk about regarding um, the exhibit, because besides the photo and the tiny bit of info, there's literally nothing else I could find about it. Hopefully that changes in the future, but you never know. But I could not find anything else regarding the exhibit, no matter what, how hard I looked or what search engine I used. But this is not the only cool thing I found regarding this, like, Puffin Stuff presence at Universal Studios, as and now our next topic is... Puffin Stuff's screen use costume was used for meet and greets at the theme park. Yup. I thought the only public, like, thing like that that the screen use costumes were used for was the freaking tournament of Roses Parade that I talked about before when Puffin Stuff had its own float. That also used the screen use costumes, but I thought that was, like, the one off thing, but no. Apparently, Universal Studios had the screen use costumes used as walk runs as well. Um, sadly, there's not as much info tied to these ones, like, um, so there's not as much info as I'm talking about regarding them, but how do I know these are screen use costumes? Simple. I've been analyzing the Puffin Stuff costumes, like, many of the Puffin Stuff costumes that were officially made for a while now, and each little one has its own unique style and differences, some worse than others. And when you compare the photos here, and compared to the screenshots from the actual TV show, it's a one-to-one -one match. So yeah, these are screen-used costumes. But strangely enough, they didn't use the floppy mouth version of Puppet Stuff's costume, like um, the Tormentor of Roses did. Instead, they used the costume that had the puppeteering head, which would usually have the puppeteer use both arms to control Puppet Stuff's mouth, while the arms are just floppy doll arms. So... In, in both pictures, you can see the costume performers holding Puff Stuff's head up, because it's probably too heavy for him. But, besides the that, that's all I could find about this event regarding Puff and Stuff at Universal Studios. Like, I, I could not find anything else. So, sadly, it looks like another Puff and Stuff event has not been well documented. So, yeah. That's all I have to talk about, guys. Um... Hopefully more uh, photos and info of this surface hell, maybe even footage at some point. Who knows? But until then, I'll see you next time.